What is good, y'all? Shanti Smooth Game back in there with yet another rebuild episode, baby. And today we are trying to go ahead and get through these playoffs, see if we can make another run at it. Last year, you saw we at least made it to the divisional round. Can we even make out the wild card run still? I don't know. We're going to get a look at that in a second. We're going to come through these stats. In a year where everything went down, we got worse than everything you can think of offensive yards, passing, rushing, defensive yards, passing, rushing, all that stuff. Everything went down. Josh Garland almost hit a 4,000 yards, 31 and 15, though. Not a terrible rookie campaign. Would have liked to see less interceptions, though. Alvin Kamara, 1,275 yards, 14 touchdowns, almost 500 out of Josh Garland, and seven touchdowns for Latavius Murray. A good supporting run cast. It was just the passing wasn't up to where I wanted it to be. We did have a thousand yard receiver and MT did close, but let's be honest, we should have two, if not three, and trauma should be around 400 or 700. So, I mean, that's 300 more yards, 100 more yards, and about 200 more yards that need to, that need to be find their way onto the team, some kind of way. I need y'all to go ahead and get some more yards. 12 touchdowns for Deontay Harris. Obvious number one option right now, and that's easy when MT is taking the best corner out of the equation, basically. You know, we look at uh, sacks allowed. You see Deion Gordon, the rookie, gave up 13. Uh, played quite a bit of snaps. One of the most healthiest offensive line we've had. He only missed, I mean, I guess you could say if, like, Pete made every start, he only missed about 14 downs. He probably missed more than that. But 13 sacks, that's rough. I mean, it doesn't help that our quarterback moves out the pocket a lot either. Though. Like, he's rushing, he's scrambling. So some of those sacks aren't even him. It's the quarterback getting out the pocket. Uh, Demario Davis and Marshawn Latimer were both over 100 tackles. Oh, my gosh, two Three, four of my top five tacklers with DBs. That's why all our stats down. Where, why is my defensive line not up here getting tackled? Where are the other linebackers at getting tackles? All I see is DB, DB, and more DBs. Do we have a nope, good sack production this year? Marcus Davenport, 14 and a half. Cameron Jordan getting around nine. I'll take that. Wish we had a little bit more supporting, though. You know, I don't like that steep drop off to four and a half. But Marshawn Lattimore, what a year. Got to be getting defensive uh, player of the year. Nine interceptions this year. That's got to be, he's only a superstar right now, and I don't think it went up uh, recently. So that's got to go up to superstar expected. He had a big week. Oh, snap, we got spoiled. Oh, that's a deep player. We obviously spoiled already. He did. Can't see right there that he will make the Pro Bowl roster. But two interceptions in the last game. Got to be a league leader. Not, yep, nine interceptions. Led the way. Who led the way in sacks, though? Uh, 22 and a half, D4. This first off scene, I think I've seen him up here in like anybody else's series, anything like that. He's actually become a beast. 22 and a half sacks. And that was like, that's basically over a third of his tackles were sacks because he only had 60 of them. Going back over here, the lead leaders in receiving. You see Calvin Ridley up there, Randall Cobb over 1,500. Terry McLaurin and Stephen Diggs right behind him. 13 touchdowns there from Randall Cobb. 100 receptions for both Godwin and Mike. That, I might need to use Tampa Bay's offensive play, but they passed the ball. They throw the rock. Nick Chubb, Joe Mixon, Derrick Henry, the usual top three that you would probably expect. AK still slipping behind. Dang, two running backs getting over 20. Four running backs getting over 20 touchdowns. 24 by Z, 21 by Chubb, 20 Mixon, and 20 Saquon. Those are the teams that I don't wish to play, even though I think we know we lost to the Cowboys. Yeah, the teams that I don't want to play. Dang, Tom Brady, 5,500 yards. Only 39 touchdowns, though. Patrick Holmes, 49 with 17 picks, over 5,000 as well. And Matt Ryan also clips over 5,000 on a team that was doing some, well, 23 picks, only 34 touchdowns. That's why they're doing it. I mean, he's throwing the rock because he also has to. I don't know what it is with these NFC teams, but every team but ours, we got 463, 417. I bet y'all go look at our core base. Nowhere close. Look at that. 538. Almost 100, more, 100 less attempts than those dudes. A little bit more than 100 less attempts. We need to get up in those stats. I need Josh Garner to throw the rock like that. And I know they're division points. Let's go ahead and check out the team, though, as we're in the playoffs. We're going to see what they're looking like. Still got CMC at a 99. Brian Burns, DJ Moore. Looks like it's pretty spread out over their top players. They got Cam. Uh, like we already know, he's only 76, though. But just like in real life, he ended up going back to Carolina. Running back core still pretty strong with a good backup. Receiving core, we got DJ Moore. Cortland Sutton working 13. Devin Punch is rocking 11. David Moore, Terrence Marshall Jr. I mean, this is a solid receiving core. Let's be honest. There's, there's no reason why they're not, you know, there's a good reason to why they're the two seed and almost was the one seed. Like, this receiving core is nice. And today, Marshawn Lattimore, I need you to step up and shut him down. 
Kyle Fuller, I need you to step up and shut him down because you've been giving up a lot of deep passes. This the offensive line, we better eat. baby playoff atmosphere we got the all whites on today and hopefully that means that we're gonna get a dub not if you do that i like the energy we're already on though coming out with a pass play josh garland staying in the pocket and throwing i like the all white music though i didn't even pick that either they automatically came out with the all white like color rush let's let's like play swaggy go score a touchdown we obviously lost this team two times in the regular season so looking to get some redemption i think that was a reach for the first he reached for the first Oh, another drop back. Ah, out to the flats. It looks like we're just running slants. I think all three of the pass plays have been slants. I mean, if, it, if it's working, keep doing it. Okay, there we go. I see people going down the field just for a screen. Come on, y'all. Let's see what they got the third and 13. Here we go. Drop back. Oh, good pass. There we go, Deontay Harris. Just as I say, this might be only a check down type of thing. We get a third and long and convert. Still thinking about changing that playbook, though. I don't know. Maybe maybe not. There was another playbook I did like. I ain't going to tell who. Just in case I do switch to it, it'll be a surprise. There goes a good run from Alvin Kamar, trucking his way forward to the 43. Here we go, team. We move the ball. Almost got stalled up, but we've been able to per persevere. Hand off, or not hand off. Throw again to Adam Troutman. Getting another first. This is what I want to see more of. Consistency with the offense. I need to see them work drives, move drives. And I need to not have happen what's happened before when they've done this to me. And if you watch the other episodes, you know exactly where I'm going with this. If you, if you don't know what I'm going with this, stop right now. Go watch some other episodes, catch back up, and then recontinue this video. Because, first of all, you're spoiling it. You don't even know how we got here, where the rebuild started. Go check out them other videos. And how is that not P.I.? I ain't missed that. Eight pass plays to two run plays? What team is this? This is not what we're used to. Where was he throwing that to? Is there, you can't even... Oh, with aggressive smooth too? Who is this team? They know me going to do this when I'm actually like calling the plays, calling the plays. All right, all right, I see you. Oh, no, not a run. Oh, he charged his way forward. He mushed him out the way for the first. Wait, what? He didn't get the first? Oh, no, that's big cap. 4,000 yards for Cam. Okay, they got him with the dreads. That's kind of swaggy. Oh, why can't my, my player look like that? But no, nah, ain't no way. Did they really not count that as a first? He definitely fell over the line of scrimmage. They didn't. Oh, no. We got to exit and go watch that replay. They didn't count that as a first? The ball definitely went over the line. Well, defense, I need y'all to get a stop. We ain't going to think about it too much. Look at that. Karma always coming back. All right, good. The play is still here. Didn't get deleted. Let's see. Where's that first down? I might have to turn this way. All right, so first down is at the third, the 20. Boom, met at the line, stiff arm. Look, nothing touches. Yo, y'all see that, right? Both legs are out, are not on the ground. Doesn't touch here. Gets flipped over the defender. That should definitely be spotted at like the 19 or 18. Definitely be spotted at the 19 or 18. Come on, defense. Let's, let's, hey, let's hope karma come through. Let's get our revenge back, man. We, we know we deserve the ball right now. Then we'll go out to the flat. Somebody get there on CMC. Great tackle. I think that is CJ on the tackle. I keep almost wanting to call that man CJJ. You know, <laughs> CJ Garner Johnson. But, hey, at least he was up there to make the tackle. Cam in the pocket again. Almost getting a sack. Come on, come on. Uh -uh. Yeah, give him the same spot we got. Tackle down, fourth and one. Now, are they going to match the same energy and go for it? Bad juju always got to happen. Thankfully, it wasn't a pick like normal. But let's hope that we can go ahead and get back right on the second drive. Adam Troutman once again, looking like the main target today. You already know that's normally Deontay Harris's territory, man. But it looks like today we're going with a little more Adam Troutman. Motion. Handoff will go to uh Smith. Right? No, to Harris. My bad there. Yeah, I did mean Harris on that run. Getting this enough for the first. Let's keep this ball moving, though. First and ten. Three minutes left in the first quarter. Throw will go out. Adam Troutman again on a little stop route. 
I would love to see a deep pass here. That would be actually great. I know we don't need that many yards, but okay, play fake. Why out to Alva Kamara? At least MT would have got us. Oh my god! Dog, oh, bro. What? AK. AK. Yo, no, we in this instant replay. Speed it up. <laughs> Speed it up. Look, look. Oh, wait, we gotta hide that. Okay, first of all, the jump cut to the greatness. To the get up out of my way, blood. They said, excuse me, sir, you're not allowed in the club. Move. <laughs> excuse me, I lift. So you talking to my girl? Move out the way. <laughs> my dude got thrown out the way like a little baby. He said, hey, hey, first time tackling AK, it's going to be a breeze. Come here, big fella. Oh, he got a, he got a film session with Coach Sturdy tomorrow. <laughs> And I can't wait to see it come through. <laughs> Just gonna piss down my leg. Kind of get mushed out the way like my mama used to. Mm. <laughs> Yo, I don't even care if we lose now, but that was moment of the year. <laughs> moment of the series. He threw him all the way out the club for the first. That is, he is just throwing people out the club. Keep running the ball with AK. Glad to see somebody angry for losing to this team twice this season, man. <laughs> we trying to get this victory today. All right, throw out, go over. Josh Garland, your accuracy is boo boo, bro. We need to work on field general. All practice, we on. Uh, we got Drew Brees coming in. He's working accuracy with you. Because even on the medium stuff, your accuracy is. Eh. Drop back. Looks like it's a clean ish pocket about to collapse. Throw those out. MT holds on for it. And when in doubt, give it to the man with clout. And we still driving. We in the red zone, basically. Drop back, clean pocket, about to collapse, and that is a sack. Fumble ball is loose and rolling out. They'll pick it up, and it looks like he's going to be able to rumble and bumble his way to the end zone. AK is trying to speed up, but there is not enough room. All right, look, I know I said I didn't care if we win. I still want to win, though. Josh Garland, I need you to stop making mistakes. That's the second time today you've made a mistake. Play fake here. Latavius Murray, because I guess AK is probably tired after trying to spray after their carrier. First play in the second quarter. As it's looking at another shotgun look here. Not much under center. Not much pistol today. Could be another run here. Oh, fake. Goes to AK backside. That's a good job. We already ran with Harris earlier today. Run the fake. Pistol look here. Drop back. Throw it out. Quick. That's Marquez Callaway with the catch. Getting down. That must have been our spread look. Put four receivers on the field. Callaway's first look on first play of the day. First catch of the day as well. Drop back. Throw it out again, Adam Troutman. We're being slow and methodical. Like I said, a lot of short game, a lot of quick passes. Already completed 14 passes and only 85 yards. Not what I like to see. But who knows, it might lead to a 300-yard game. Maybe. Oh, my goodness. How did Brian Burns get in the backfield so quick? Regardless, we got third and five. Can we get another first here? They're trying to go to all reliable, and it was off target. Badly. I haven't seen much of the defense. We're going to go ahead and check out another defensive drive real quick. Why not? Let's see if we can go ahead and get a stop here, D. Stopped them last time. Oh, come on. Somebody's got to come up for that interception. Cam Newton was way off on that throw. Somebody got to go get that pick. But this offensive line, weak. So I need to see some more defensive pressure. Let's see if we really get it. There we go. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There we go. Sack for Cameron Jordan. I think that was even their strong tackle. The right tackle should be the best offensive lineman they have. And we were able to still get that sack. So, third and 16. This might give us great field position if we don't get them back in the backfield for safety. Go big run. Oh, big run up the middle for CMC. Clearing out some room, but they're going to have to punt the ball. I was going to go take a trip up to the booth real quick, grab me a soda and a snack. But we in our side of the territory for one of the rare times today. And we're actually starting here. So, hopefully, the momentum can pick up and won't die off until we're at least in field goal range. That's, that's the hope anyway. Second and eight. Drop back. Throw goes out. Great catch. That, where are you going, Deontay Harris? Need another play here. There goes Adam Troutman quick. He's throwing the ball before he has a chance to turn around. From the 25. Quick throw goes out. This time we're seeing Traquan Smith get his first look of the day. First catch. And we're over 100 yards. And Josh Garland's hype. He's excited to be in the red zone for what? Like the first, first actual time today. First and 10 here after a 12-yard catch from Traquan. Hand off to AK. Let's ride him all the way to the – no, AK, you've been doing – oh, okay. I think we picked it up. We've been doing so good on fumbles, and he finally let one loose. 
Thankfully, we were able to pick it up, though, keep the ball with us. Second and two, we're five yards away from Pater. Let's get in this end zone. Probably going to be another handoff. Oh, no. That is the backup, too. Obviously, our rookie left tackle is hurt, so Cheney having to come in being our best next available person. That is not what you want to see from your bench offensive lineman. Here we go. Now we got 10 yards to go. It looks like nobody's going to get there, and that's another sack fumble from Josh Garland. He, no one wants to hold on to the rock today. You fumbled twice on, on both times that you've been sacked. Throw it out. Throw it out. Throw it out. Get it AK. Because if you got hit, you fumbling. You, I guess we're just going to have to take our three and hope the defense gets another stop. If we get a stop, we should have another chance before the end of the half to at least tackle on another field goal if they don't run out the rest of the second quarter. So let's see what they do here. They're going with a play fake. Throwing it right over the middle, and he got Moss. I think that is DJ or uh, Yeah, DJ Moore should be at least wearing number two. Just worked Kyle Fuller. First catch of the game for him. Two-minute water and water break is over. It's time to go back to work. Stop this team again. They're wide open. Who is that? That's Paulson Adebo. I need somebody other than Marshawn Lattimore to step up and make plays in the secondary. CJ, you've been doing all right. Mark Swing, you've been quiet today. But them two other DB or corners has been trash. And now Tim Settles hurt. Only about 90 seconds left in this first half. Can we get a sack? They sent a corner blitz and... Yo, is Kyle Fuller even playing defense? He gave up such a cushion there to Devin Punches, and it looks like they're about to get their second touchdown of the game. I saw we tried to send it, it looked like maybe a nickel blitz, didn't get there, so the coverage has to be on point. He caught it off the tip. D, top of y'all to do what y'all do, man. I need, I need some stops. I need some stops. That's not a good way to start out, but Devin punches for the first. I'm not going to lie, I'm an early panicker. So, you know, right now the game looks very out of hand for me unless I was actually on the sticks playing. But th there we go. When Cameron Jordan gets a second, it's like that. Oh, and we injured Cam. We might have a real chance now. Oh, uh, yeah. Cam Newton out. I forgot who is the best. Sam Darnold's the backup. Let's get him. Go get that. Yeah, hand off the CMC. Because ain't nowhere else to go. I can't. Who just got drugged? Davenport, weight room. And Cameron Jordan and X Factor. Let's get right, Cameron. Get right. Get right. Come, get right, bro. You an X Factor. What are you doing? No, no Marshawn. Well, ain't nobody in X Factor no more. Oh, that was a waste of X Factor. You didn't even get in the backfield. Oh, you, you doing better without the X Factor. What the? Look at that. Look at that work. Now, that was Marcus Davenport there with the sack, but Cameron Jordan did so much better without the X-Factor. And they, they stay actually out of X-Factor. Yeah, we get more pressure that way. Between him and Davenport, bro, we should be in the backfield every play, eating. They should have to do that, quick passes, because th there should be no time to throw the ball. Draw back, only rushing three this time. Have to dig it down to CMC. At the 37, that might be field goal range for them. That should be about a 52-yarder. Can they make that? Oh, they ran off fake. No. Y'all got hit with the fake. Third and two here. Throw out. Come on, y'all. Sam Darnold came in. He's playing better than Cam right now. How is this? Why? Y'all should be eating. First of all, we should be eating on this offensive line. We should be beasting the pieces. Easy work. Then on top of that. Oh. 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 I mean, we got one last chance, basically. I mean, we're down, uh, what's that, 17, 18 points. About to hit the fourth quarter. We need a touchdown here. Or basically, the game, say goodbye to it. Run by Alvin Kamara. I mean, he's been beastly, but probably not what I would call on the first drive, you know, on the first play of the drive. I thought Alvin Trotman probably ain't it either. I'd probably be wanting to score quick. You know, we probably go down the field, maybe hit MT on a post, you know, considering he's got that uh, ability to – to go up and get that. Look, look, but they want to throw slant routes where the receiver dives back for an easy pick. I went up to the booth to go get my snacks for the day because this game is probably all but done. We are getting the end of the third quarter, down 18, and they are driving like nobody's business behind Sam Darnold. Cam Newton wasn't doing a dang thing. They switched quarters because he got hurt. They might stay with him for the rest of the playoffs. Uh, we're going into the fourth quarter, and it looks like they will go ahead and... Oop, 
We stopped it and delayed it. We only held it to a field goal. Good. Now we'll see if the offense does anything, but basically down 21. Anybody get rocked back? We about to be 21 skunk. So, okay. Now we're moving the rock. Now see if the pass base go down the field. Here we go. First and 10. Ah, there goes Jerry Cheney. If I could cut him, I would. Do we have the depth to cut him? No. Pick Josh Garland. Can't go a game without those. You know we had 15 of them during the season. pitiful game it went from bad to worse in that fourth quarter Josh Garland threw two interceptions um, back to back drives that led to field goals and touchdowns they almost scored there again at the end we just got lucky Tom right now and they were, didn't really want to but you see the splits here from Cam Newton to Sam Darnold honestly it looked like uh, passer rating says Cam played better I don't know I, I say Sam Darnold played better he, like I said while he was watching the game he was like 7 for 7 uh, threw a touchdown led him down the field Josh Garland, I mean, I guess this is just, you know, chalk it up to being a rookie in the playoffs. AK was doing his thing, but didn't have enough time to really do much of after, like, the first quarter when we were down two scores, basically, for the rest of the game. We're just a young team rebuilding. Just wasn't our season, wasn't our time yet. But we will get right, we will come back, and we will be rejuvenated and better. Do I think we're getting a quarterback? Probably not, because I'm not going to be in the range to pick up either of the four that I would probably want. Any of the five, probably, they're probably all five going to be going before my pick, to be honest. So, I'm about to take our, our game out of the way. At least we had that amazing highlight play. Get back to the drawing board. And that basically will all but do our season, man. I'm not going to fire <clears throat> or hire anybody. I mean, yeah, the offense was 17, defense 14. We're about middle of the road. Nothing was too bad. We just got some things that we need to pick up. We got a young team. Do want to go into managed staff real quick, though. I work on our player tree. Obviously, we have 210 staff points built up throughout the season this year. Obviously, we had a great season. So, uh, far exceeding expectations. We've got the staff modifications all the way done. We do want to, well, not all the way done. We can go ahead and get, you know, them locked up a little bit. Let's go ahead and get, well, how much is this? This is 20. Spend that 20 to go ahead and get their, their points a little bit cheaper. And this is a 10% refund when we replace them. I don't really need that right now. I'm not going for two. Uh, we could go ahead and work on either offense or defense to gain that extra XP boost. I think I want that to be defense. Uh, if we look over here, is there anything I would want to buy over here? Boost blocking for tight ends, don't really care. This is boost pass blocking for plus three. Receivers and awareness for offensive linemen. Strength for offensive line. I mean, that would that would be nice to get. We can go 16 here. Oh, oh. Here we go. Go junky there. Can I get this now? Nope. Ah, 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 ah. ah. There we go. Got that. Boost it twice. Now can I get it? No. Okay, so I guess I gotta get this. Bam. Can I get it now? Okay, yeah, we can get it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, it is available first. Bam. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Get my uh boost, my offensive alignment strength. We're gonna do that. Looks like this talent tree practice makes perfect is already done. Oh wait, there's one more that could have been upgraded. Something I want to upgrade fully. Ah, ah, ah. Boost wide receivers release. Oh yeah, need that. Get that. So now my offensive coordinator is kind of where we want him. We obviously can maximize a little bit more, getting this one up if we want to, getting this one up if we want to. Uh defensive coordinator. Looks like he's down the path of pursuit for linebackers, defensive tackles, and then boosting their strength, which probably could be pretty nice. See, boosting catching for free safety, stamina, tackling, and down here will be boosting press for corner. Okay. 
probably start working on that next. Uh, corner is definitely what I want to get, but obviously we probably can't touch that. And two. So I got to at least buy this one, 16, this one, 16. And then we can get weight room, but we wouldn't even have enough. So it's either that and get it set up, or do we come over here and buy this 16, buy that 16. Probably be able to buy that one, get the tackling up. And then we'd be able to get the roadblock. Do we want press for our man coverage corner? Yeah, I want to work on my press. I'm tired of my corners being trash. So we're going to go ahead and go down this list. Spend these last. Oh, dang, I ain't going to have enough to get down there all the way to the bottom. We'll end with 10. That's not too bad. I like where the skill trees are working out. I haven't even thought about, you know, player personnel stuff yet. Ooh, Matt. And here you go with the Pro Bowl roster. I'm not sure how many people we got. Obviously, you see AK was halfback three. Let me know if you see any of your favorite players on here as well. Let me know what you guys are thinking of the series and if you guys are ready to go ahead and head into another offseason and try to further this rebuild, fix our money situation, and see if we can get back into these playoffs again. There goes Ryan Ramsky for right tackle. Um, see if anybody else has made it. It doesn't look like so. Marshawn Lattimore, obviously Q, uh, cornerback one. I'm going to say QB. Marcus Williams for free safety two. CJ uh, Johnson, strong safety one. That's what, four players? Four or five players? I'm not too mad at it. And now we can go see who why the playoffs shook up. And here's how the playoff tree went, man. The Bills ended up beating the Chargers. Browns beat Titans. Jets beat Bengals. Only to get beasted and feasted by the Bills. Chiefs beat the Browns. And the Chiefs went back to the Super Bowl by a score of 31-12 against Buffalo. On our side, Carolina ended up making it all the way to the championship game, beating Seattle, who ended up beating Arizona. Dallas beat the football team. Then got beasted on by the Packers, and the Packers ended up taking care of Carolina. So, at least nobody from our division is going to win it. But we got a Packers, Chiefs, basically a number one seed Super Bowl. My money's on the Chiefs. Here goes a quick look at the yearly awards. Russ for MVP. Coach of the year was Matt Wool of the Panthers. Did coach him to a pretty good record. Let's see if we had any players win any awards. You see anybody from our team? Let me know. Marshawn Lattimore is down there at fifth. Josh Garland got rookie of the year. Maybe that'll do something for his development. Uh, defense, nobody. Uh, QB, running back Kamara finished fifth. Receiver, Harris finished sixth. Other than that, y'all gotta let me know. Do y'all see any player of your favorite players on here? Arshon Lambert, number one. CJ, number three. I like it. Kicker, number three for Will Lutz. Just like the jersey number on his back. And here he is with an upgrade. I told y'all we were going with field general from now on because them accuracies was atrocious. 77, plus two mid. That's what we needed, plus two awareness. Still only at normal dev. I was really hoping rookie of the year would have got him at least to star dev. So that kind of sucks. But maybe next year. Oh, after upgrade, Marshawn Lenamore is, he at least got his superstar X Factor. So now he will have X Factor abilities and his is shut down. Erase receivers from the game when they enter the zone, their coverage is tighter and interceptions are more frequent on consistent catches. I like it. We finally got an X-Factor corner. Now it's time to boost the other corners around him so they don't just start throwing to Kyle Fuller. And what did I tell you, man? The Chiefs went ahead and won it again. Third Super Bowl, third, third time. Third time winning the Super Bowl, three times Super Bowl champs. Went to the AFC Championship game. Come on, guess that's three, supposed to be three times. Six times for the NFC side. Uh, the MVP was Cody Barton. That left us on backer. Must have had a lot of bad interceptions or a sack. You see Josh Garland's name over there for rookie of the year. Surprised he won it, but you know, we'll take the XP that came with it and hope for a ratings boost eventually. Next time out, we will be going through you know the off season. You already know how that's gonna go, man. We're gonna try to keep the key guys that we need to, even though I think we did that pretty much during the season because we have negative eight million anyway. So anybody that's not signed is kicking rocks. And from there, we'll just have to go to the draft and hope that we can draft people to fill in any empty holes that we got. Keep working here at left tackle. Hopefully that uh, overall gets better. Make sure at least the other five stay here, stay strong. Would love to get maybe an upgrade here, but you know, we're gonna rock with it. The receivers are playing great. Another year of development for Josh Garland. He's gonna be fine. I think going up from what, 73, 74 to 77 in one year, I'll take it. Defense, this is, this is the strength right here. I mean, I'd love to get a, a boost here somewhere, maybe I don't know, but they ain't on his team. I'd love to get a boost here for somewhere. We obviously, I think I did end up signing KJ right back though. So hopefully, hopefully I made that decision. If not, then our outside linebacker spots are very weak, actually. Uh, we got good safeties, good corners. Now X Factor corner over there. Kyle Fuller, I didn't sign back, so he'll be gone. So it's gonna be interesting, obviously. We got a lot of hosts. 
and no money to do that. Let's get to work. All right, man. If y'all enjoyed it, it's me, your boy, Shot Too Smooth, aka Black and Black and Tiger King Leo, and Coach Smooth will figure this out some way, and we're going to get back right. I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm gone. Peace. <laughs>